So yeah, um, today I'm doing my day and I've been enjoying the series thus far. And as you may notice, new audio, so you can hear me better. I hope, I hope, I hope you can hear me better. Oh my god, I'm not even sure. I'm just kind of shooting in the dark here. But yes, so I'm doing a, a new setup for uh, my day and this is my day episode 7, which I've been enjoying immensely this far. Um, yeah, let's see how I'm gonna react. Now in this section, uh, in this particular, uh, this particular series, I'm gonna not um, react to the whole whole thing because I've seen what people are doing to this um, is that they only react to portions of it. So that's what I'm gonna do as well. I don't I don't wanna I don't wanna get in trouble. I just wanna show you guys how I feel. That's all. Okay, so <laughs> that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, and I'm gonna hit play now. Oh, that is such a nice shot! Oh, she's so sad! Oh, that is heartbreaking, though! Oh, No one wants to see sad Kim. We don't want to see sad Kim. Aww. But you know, this show kind of sets her up for a new love interest, if ever. Oh, ouch, ouch, ouch. Who has not been through that? Have you not been through that? Because that hurts. A lot. I love the audio! Ah! Like, it only ch shifts. The audio of the rain only shifts when it's outside and inside. And it's just so freaking clean oh my god oh wow although i do have to kind of wonder why the why there was an episode where she was like telling um ace about her childhood like you know like ace wouldn't know that she wanted to be in fashion all this time like they just met but the thing is, they've been established as childhood friends, so I'm a little weirded out about that. I love these shots! I want to know how they've been done. Was this a drone? This was a really clean drone shot. This is so nice. Uh, na po yung mga cake designs ni Chef Manny. Mm. Here we go. Ask if you saw the, the if you see the if you saw the trailer last week, we know that there's a lot that's gonna happen in this episode. So it's gonna be jam packed, and then jam shows up. Ganda niya sa mata. Okay na. I love I love his suits. Like all his suits are so shway. Ito. I love how the re I, I feel like they are looking at a unique cake. It doesn't sound hardcore. Oh, that's it. I just got a text of what a cake looks like, and I agree. I agree. That cake looks awesome. You should try that. I saw pictures. In my condition right now. What? You know, I am. I am trying to. Get in touch um, with in the pain and, uh, producers if I can. I just don't want to drag you guys down. Sorry, ah. Huh? hindi makakatend, Chef? Okay na, settle na lahat. I wish I could do something about this, pero hindi talaga kaya is. I I hope you understand. Okay, Chef. I hope they say yes, because I'm already filming the reaction video. And I just you saw that the there was a copyright thing. I want to be. I want to do things illegally. You know what I'm saying? No time now to prepare, no? Oh, sir, no, we're going to get rid of your dad. That's what you're going to do. You're going to give your responsibility here. Aki Gagliardo's acting has gotten better and better and better since the first episode. I'll be honest, I was super harsh in the first episode because it didn't do it for me, but the next few episodes, it's been kind of a lot better, actually. Especially the scene where he was drowning, that was, wow. And the scene where he lost his dog. Oh my god, you're really top cat? Here we go, in another top show. Top show! Wait, wait, guys, wait. 
medyo malaking competition to ah. Pero Sir Ace dream na dream Ayaw mo ba ng malaki? I'm sorry, that's the first time I said Tagalog in anything in this channel. Sir Ace, nasa sa inyo po yung decision. Kaya mo ba? Sige, kung talagang top ka, patunayan mo. Sir Ace, sige. Kung talagang top ka, patunayan mo. I'm so sorry, but that is the best top joke execution I've ever heard in a Pinoy BL. Aces, Ace 10. That's gonna stay in my head for a while. While, kung talagang top ka, patunayan mo. I love this. It looks so real. Wow. I'm so involved. I feel like I'm in the kitchen with them. Well, the view is in the... What? Did we just see that? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, so cute. I love the lighting, too. Ah, yes. The infamous cake flower scene. You know, his mom's so adorable. I feel a product placement coming on. In three, two, one. I know it. I could smell the product placement coming from a mile away. But in fairness, they, they've been executing product, product solutions. Product solutions. Product placements fairly well. Almost to the level of Thai Mmm, What is that? I want to buy that. What? What the Baku? See, I was trying to read it and it disappeared. Guess I can't buy that now. What is happening? Well, we kind of know because this was in the trailer. I love how how how. I lost the words for this, but I love how ambient there. I love how ambient this shot is. It's like they're about to break into a music video. <laughs> Scary. <laughs> that was freaky. What is happening? What is happening? Wait, what is happening? Is this real? If it's a dream sequence, whose dream is it? Kaya ngayon nakahanap kayo ng katapat nyo. What? Alam nyo nang gagawin dito. What is happening? Sorry, sorry, sorry. Wait. I'm a little freaked out of what's happening right now. What is happening? I, I think it's someone's dream sequence, but who's it? His dream sequence? <sighs> he gets a dream sequence? I need to apologize. He got a dream sequence? Uh, take. I'm sorry. Uh, this is break. so interesting. I have never, literally never see seen this happen sorry no pre <laughs> anything i bought i would have kind of sana huli na to ah like... kasi pag nalaman ko pang sinaktan niyo pa si sky ako na makakalaban niyo yes yes sir yes sir yes sir <laughs> his back like went straight up oh it's all of asia oh so the thing is held by the bay i suppose his suits are always so on point alam ko na kaban to look at his outfit Pero tandaan mo, naniniwala ako sa'yo. Yee. Nanalo tayo, okay? Yee. Enjoy. Kaya natin ito, Siyempre. They're so ako. casually, Siyempre, like, they're so casually into each other. I love it. Tandaan, kailan niya. Si Bench to, Ace. Bench! Yes! Oh my God! <laughs> Ang ganda mo, Bench! Thank you, product of art and science. Sayo, so ba, Bench? Grabe. Ang ganda mo. Tinalo mo, Bench. It's been a long time. Oh my God, Bench. Ah. 
Hi. Sama namin niya. So you must be Mr. <laughs> Philippines. Yes, po. Wow, good luck. Good luck to all of you here. Oh, by the way, I'm celebrating my birthday next week. Why don't you join me at the club? That's so funny. Okay. And it's so next in character. Of oh, course so he doesn't know Jam's name. All right. Ready to party? Of course. Thank you Why so would he? much, Malita Barca. It makes so much sense. Uh, mga three months ago. Wow. How are you? I'm doing good. Uh, medyo Bench has such a well-developed competition, pero. Naniniwala ako. Oh, uh, I love Benji's right. hair. Good luck to you. Kumpanya para sa inyo, Ace. Miko Gallardo has this just supernatural yeah. way of acting that is, okay, guys, so is just a whole other level. We're about to start in 10 minutes, so please proceed to the stage. Hey, it's so a director, Sean Lee. Come in. Like, he already now. appeared to, to, to speak guy. to... Um, Ace about this competition at one Mr. point. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> so it's live stream. Okay. Interesting. Good day, everyone. Welcome to the biggest kick. Man, that actually does world. look this like. Is uh, kicks of the world a whole thing. I, I wonder really, how they really did excited. that. We have 48 kicks from all over the world coming here to Manila, Philippines to claim the grand prize. At this point, let's get to I the I love the set. Candidates. And I know that's just like part of what the one house that they use. So I'm pretty amazed at this whole thing. That is so cool, and they actually do look like they're from those countries. <laughs> I really feel like I'm part of the audience. <laughs> That's so much fun. That is so cool! It's like a whole thing! It's like a show within a show. Oh my god, it's Tori and me! These guys are, are reactors! That's so cool! Let's talk about the criteria for Wow, well, those are. I go. just realized some Original of those are theme, Easter eggs. 20%. Difficulty, 25%. Creativity, 20%. Technique use is 20%. General appearance, Paolo 50% Bidiones. for a total of 100%. The host. Let's get to meet the, the judges host. whose job I do not envy for today. Starting off with a socialite and owner of If you of want gravitas in your ben show, Sanchez. within a show, you get Paolo Bidiones. He's so pretty. We have with us multi-awarded international chef, Andre King. And finally, we have producer of Cakes of the World, Stephen Yu. Oh, so that's his name there, Stephen Yu. Okay. So, candidates, if you're ready, let's start with a competition. I am so ready. I have no idea what's going on. It's a little bit of a Wonder Woman vibe, which I like. I'm gonna watch the live stream with them. Oh, oh my god. Oh wow, that's amazing. Oh yes, I totally agree. Except they're not talking to anybody here. That's Ace's mom, by the way. It feels like a legit show. 
I'm sure you're all excited to find out who makes it to the final four. I have the results here. In my Why am I this excited win? over cakes? Well, it's cakes. And it's a contest. I've always been excited with contests, so you know, that's, that's not a thing. Our final is from... Japan! Philippines, Philippines! Congratulations! Let's bring on in Indonesia! Why am I nervous? I mean, I know, I know he's gonna Let's win. Let's add to what we have here. Brazil, come on down. <laughs> One spot Philippines, left, Philippines, and that spot belongs Philippines, to Philippines, 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 the Philippines. Yes, I knew it was gonna happen, but still exciting because of all the music and the lights. And hearing it through my earphones is just extra awesome, I'm just saying. Oh wow, the musical score on this, it really draws you There in. you have it ladies and gentlemen, these four will compete for the top prize. Who is it going to be? Find out when we return. Oh, what happened to his audio though? That's fine. That's fine. It's been a truly exciting year for Cakes of the World. And we'd like to thank all the gamblers for giving a round of applause. This is so edge of your seat, though. Wow, But Seriously. at this point, it's time to announce who will take home the top prize. Let's start out with our third runner-up. So engaging, my God. I feel like I'm going to get a headache after this. We have Japan! Sorry. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I kind of know what's going to happen. Don't you know what's going to happen? I feel like we all know what's going to happen, but it's just so... It just draws you in, man. I don't know. We only have two finalists left. Who is it going to be? I will announce the grand prize winner, who will be receiving $100,000 in cash. That's the a name lot. or the country that I don't mention will be the first runner up. So here we go. <laughs> the country that he doesn't mention will be the first runner up. So in other words, if he mentions the name, that's the winner. The grand winner of Cakes of the World 2020 is Oh wow. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, Cakes of the World I 2020 has come to an end. That. Let's see you all next year and remember, stay tasty. Holy crap. Oh wow. Oh damn. I thought he was gonna win. For, for someone who fainted, some of them were super chill about it. Well, it is a cooking show, so there was some luto involved.
Nagira pa ni Kuya yun eh. Yeah. Man, look at, look at, look at him though. Like, damn, they, they're getting so good at this. And damn, I, I honestly thought, you saw me, right? Like, I honestly thought he was gonna win this. That's, that's where it was gonna go. And then kudos to the writers for just kind of <laughs> taking it in a different direction. So I guess the one thing I can say about my day is it's not predictable. It's not predictable at all. But it was a competition, guys. He's gonna understand. I love it. <laughs> it's so random and so, but it fits so well. Like, I, I want that to put this. Can you? Yeah, yeah! May dati po ti. Dato po ti in suka po ba tayo? Kaka din! May zipizip na tayo kung ano. I don't have a yaya. Yeah. Hindi ko alam kung, ano, kung papaano ako mag explain Ako, sigurado na ko. Tatalo I mean, the live stream is right there, so. Why would you Ay, have to explain anything? I don't really totally care. Kaka na prepare na lang natin gawan. This guy. Oo nga. Maganda, pero parang bakit hindi enough? Fini ko may kulang talaga eh. No? Oh. Napaghandaan niyo ba ng mabuti? Do you guys think that there's something okay. going on behind kuyat, the scenes? Kuyat-kuyat pa there? kaya kami nun. Is there a reason why yeah. Sky yeah. didn't win? Lalo na nung... Siyempre na pressure oh, pa kami nun. No, no, you don't need to do that. You've already Shukman, seen this episode diba? probably. Ay, oo, oo. Ay, oo, ito mo. Baka lang si Chef Manny. Naku, may kinalaman niya. Bakit bigla siyang last minute na nag-backout? Ay, ako alam ko yung style na mga ganyan. Sabi pa naman. Ah. Ay, kinagwari mo naman. Na-accidente talaga. I mean, we don't know. Na-accidente sa kitchen? O, pa sino po naman yung chef ma-accident sa... Alam, Pepe? Pero wait lang. <laughs> Siguro rin kasi naka-affect. Gio, are you, are you okay? <laughs> Meron kang mga alam na hindi ko alam, Mario. Pero di ba aminin ko? Ano? It's right there. I feel like she was saying something which this is so the exact the exact way canteen talks go in the Philippines. Exactly like this. I've been in canteen talks. This is exactly how. Sinabi ko sa'yo noong una pa lang, wag na wag mong malalandi si Jam. Ano ka ba, friend lang kami ni Jam? Girl, kanabi mo na yung sa ex mo, yung Nathan? Sabi mo, friend lang kayo. Pero ano, naging jowa mo, three months. I normally don't enjoy this much supporting character shenanigans, but this is funniest. Ang pera na nalaman ito, yung suka. <laughs> also, I really do think that Yul Servo and Inyaki Torres do look like father and son. I mean, to me, that's a very believable thread. Yung sa competition, pasensya na, natalo tayo. Ano ka ba, Sky? Tapos na yun. Ang pagtanka ginawa mo yung best mo. Exactly. And you would know that. And you guys were both there. Thank you. Don't know. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, Dad, you're not going to be able to get out of here. Ah, I'm not going to be able to get out of here. This. What? Huh? 
What? Where is this coming from, Dad? Bakit di mo ginawang maayos yung trabaho mo? What do you mean? Dad, ginawa ko naman po, pero... Kasi yung chef po natin, hindi po nakapunta, kaya po... Pukaw na lang! Inasa mo na lang sa mga intern! Dad, wala po siyang kasalanan dito. Hindi pa sinabi ko sa'yo, umuha ka ng intern na huwag tatanga-tanga! Wait a minute. Diba? Dad, ako po yung may kasalanan dito. Diba, pinagtatanggol mo pa! Wait! Alam mo ba ginawa mo sa kumpanya natin? But that was a competition! Simple lang gagawin mo! Dad, come on! Ano, tigitana ka! Is pag tatanggol mo ba yan? Ang ayoko sa lahat! Yung mga inutil! Incompetent! Dad, ako nga po may kasalanan! Now you see where he gets it from. Wala po siya kasalanan dito! His father. Oh, pinapaya mo ako lagi. Simple lang. Di mo magawa ng maigi. So in case you were wondering where he gets his mean streak, there it is. Paano si Mel? Dad, wala nga po siyang kasalanan. Paano si... Ako, suma ako pa magpaalis dyan? Sky. Oh fudge. Okay, so so they got they got rid of the the Connor conflict. So that they could introduce the dad conflict. Which I feel is a much step by step ni mo paginawa. Bakit ba gusto nyo lagi? Laging tama. Masama bang magkamali? Eh, lagi kang nagkakamali. Nasaan yung ginawa mong tama? Sige nga, simula nung pinasok kita sa opisina, nasaan yung ginawa mong tama? I don't... I don't get... Lagi ka ba? The pressure of having to win a competition at all. It's a competition. Kasi pag nagsasalita ako, hindi ka nakikinig! It's a... It's an objective... And Hindi ako doon, di mo pa alam. Out of your control kind of thing. Akala ko so, pa naman okay. Tapos pwede kang iwala mo si intern na yun? Ha? Now, if you want to blame ano anyone, wouldn't you blame yourself? Dad, sinunod ko lang yung sabi niyo sa akin. Ano ba talagang dapat kong gawin? Bakit hindi niyo po kayang tanggapin ang pagkatalo? Bakit? Good point. Ano ba meron kayong dalawa? Ha? Ano ba meron sa inyong dalawa? Dad, wala po. Nung wala, kung makapagtanggol ka, wagas. Dad, wala po kasi yung kasalanan. Haven't heard that in a while. Ayaw na ayaw ko nang makikita yan pagbumuka na yan dito sa opisina. Oh my God. That guy brought you first runner up. Who could have done that among your interns, really? Really? I feel like this is one wall that's gonna be tough to break. We've seen a lot of tough to break BL parents. This is one of the hardest to break BL parents, I think. This is... okay. This is... Oh my god, I get that. It's kind of like a panic attack going on there. Dang, that was real. I've seen people treat themselves like that. This is so weird. They're treating a first runner-up win as a loss. Which it kinda is, but it's still first runner-up though. It's like they lost in the biggest way. What if... The thing is, what if he didn't even make first runner-up, right? That would have been so much worse. Damn. This song, by the way, is...
probably one of my favorites. Like, in all the Pinoy BLs, it's one of the best songs that's out there. Man, just, wow, that was intense. Like, but the thing is, that's how parents are, right? Sometimes they're like, they're unreasonable. And when they're unreasonable like this, it makes it all the more scary to to be true to yourself. Which is, which is why I get what's happening to Ace right now. I mean, you'd think he would have been happy because they got... They got placed. But apparently, for him, it was a requirement to win. And if he didn't win... Funny thing, that's an Asian parent trope. <laughs> wow. I love how this song is so ethereal and it just really cuts into your heart. It's the it's my favorite song in the entire My Day soundtrack. Oh yeah, this that is was, guy, my was really intense. Friend? Friend ba talaga? Ikaw talaga. <laughs> wait lang, wait lang, Ace. <laughs> si ben, Their outfits. Si ben siya. Wala this guy, yung ingay mo. Wala yun, syempre Ace pa rin ako. Lasing na naman. One, two, three. Ano pa yun, anak pa, ulit ulit. O dahan dahan naman, anak. Oh, what's gonna happen? So casual. Pero asang ka? Kung ano ano ipinag abalahan mo jan? Ano ba problema mo? Sky nagsiselos ako. Nagsiselos din ako is. Sky. What? Alam kung bago pa sa iyo. Bago din pa sa akin. Sky, sorry. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. <laughs> this whole thing just went <laughs> Which is actually fine. It's it's episode eight. It's 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 a I feel like it's a fairly natural progression so far. Ah wow, that was a doozy. I am enjoying my day so far. It's in it's in, it's in it's it's in one of my top four. Which I haven't revealed. It's in one of my top four BLs. And, um, I admit I was very harsh on the first episode, which I didn't record anything for, so you may not know what, what I was harsh about. But everything just got better. Um, but the production values have always remained consistently excellent. And, uh, you know, that's one of the reasons why it's one of my favorites. It stays true to BL tropes. But at the same time, it adds a lot of Filipino flavor, and it, as, as, as far as I know right now, um, it's not heteronormative. Um, it, it presents, you know, despite the interviews that um, Inyaki Torres did before, um, it presents the LGBTQA plus experience, especially for someone who's closeted, for, for two people, or at least one person who is closeted. 
and takes you inside his mind and his experiences and why it's not so easy to come out, especially in a situation or in a society like this in the Philippines. And I think that's incredibly important to have this message come across in a mainstream media type thing. And kudos to the team of my day, Sean Lim, Iñaki Torres, Miko Gallardo, for consistently um, championing the LGBTQA plus stories and you on, on your own take on it, on them rather. And yeah, I'm going to be here for the next episode, my day, day episode 8, which will be next week. Oh, by the way, visit um, voicelove.fandom.com to visit the fandom section about my day. So there's um, character pages, episode pages, and whatnot there. And we are looking for editors all the time. So if you want to feel, if you feel like contributing, go ahead and do that. It's open for everybody. Just make sure that whatever you put is sourced, and um, we're doing justice to our fandom. That's why we are on fandom.com. Okay. Anyway, like I said, till next time. Toodles.